I was telling you before, I love love stories and I know you're engaged. I don't think you're supposed to get married anytime yeah. soon. So I don't think we're going to see any wedding stuff online, yeah. but I wanted to know the story. <laughs> no. Like I love love stories. So what is your love story? How did you and your fiance meet? So we met through a mutual friend. So the guy who got me into the girl group at the time, um, he, we were out one day and he saw my partner from afar. I didn't know him at this point. And he was like, oh, that's my friend. Let's go say hello. So then we ended up meeting my partner and they said hello. And then he looked at me and he was like, you are the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. And I was like, I know it, it sounds like you should be like, oh, but I was like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'm really bad at taking compliments. Um, and it just reminds me of like when you're walking down the street and you see guys honking their horns and <laughs> saying, oi, oi. And I was just like, that, that thought was going through my head. And I was like, okay, nice one. Um, and that was literally it. It was like 20 second chat. And then the next day he somehow found me on social media because <clears throat> he didn't know who I was because um, he's like not in the industry or anything like that. And um, he just sent me this long essay saying that I really want to take you on a date, blah, 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 blah. And I ignored it for like two weeks um, <laughs> because from Instagram, it went to Facebook. From Facebook, it went to Snapchat. And I was like, this guy just will not leave me alone because I don't respond to guys on social media, especially guys that are like your heart or your this. I, they just don't get a response. And so to me, he was one of them. And then um, how he, he's very smart. How he, sw he switched it, he said, I have a work opportunity for you. Um, and I was like, oh, nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, what's the work opportunity? And he's like, I, I want you to model for my company. And I was like, okay, great, let's set up a meeting. Um, but it's, it's really funny because you see all these messages and I don't respond. And then it, it comes to work and I'm like, okay, well, it's a work opportunity. I'm going to take it. And then um, we ended up meeting. And this was the time when I was uh, auditioning for the girl group. So this is in 2016. And um, we were just talking and talking. And by the end of it, I was like, so you do realize that this is a work meeting. Like what's going on? And he's like, yeah, I want you to model for my company. Till this day, I've never modeled for his company. <laughs> <laughs> so he's, he's, a, he's a smart he's a smart, he's smart guy yeah. but it's, it's one of those things like I'm not easily attracted to people it's, it's, it's more of a mind thing for me so it takes time for me to grow and really learn about you and, and that's what it was with him like the more I saw him the more I saw how genuinely nice he is and he's very caring um, and he's just he's just an overall great person so then I decided you know what he's good for me and he's very supportive because I know I've seen um, when you've been performing, he's like the ultimate like stage manager, like taking videos. And yeah, yeah. I think even DJing, I think when you performed uh, on that tour, yeah, I, like, yeah. I love it. He, he He's a great DJ. So even during lockdown, like he's really been teaching himself how to properly DJ. So he's, he's amazing now. He's, he's like a professional. Um, so it's nice. Like we, we can do all these things as a duo. Like we, we help each other out and it's really important. It's very important to be with someone who supports your career and your dreams um, because it's easy to find people who are insecure about what you do, especially the industry I'm in. I'm around people all the time and it, it can be hard for a lot of people to, to tolerate it. But with him, he pushes me like continuously and that's that's what you need absolutely so the advice for guys if they are crushing on a girl and she blows them off like 10 20 times don't give up don't give up because look at you guys but they have a work opportunity <laughs> hey, we gotta make that money honey <laughs>